Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Knights of the Old Republic. Alrighty, when we left off, we had, uh, well, we had tried to bring the Banthas over to the, uh, hunter over there, the Twi'lek hunter. I forget his name, unfortunately. And, uh, we had run into a problem. <laughs> and, uh, we had to reload all the way back to get it fixed um and then we managed to fix it uh this time we managed to get back without you know murder managed to get the bantha at least a little bit closer but we still need to get them even further away so uh just waiting for the force points to recharge on both of our jedis here and then we can focus on that Bring them further along. Hopefully we don't get attacked again. Achuta. We don't! Good! Okay. Achuta. Good job! Come to me. Okay. Comad. Comad. Comad Fortuna. That's right. That's right. Now we got them here. Quickly! Be ready! The Banthas are in position and will soon stir our restless prey. I hope the mines do their job quickly. I'm ready. Wait, what is that rumbling sound? Oh boy, he's a big one. Um. Oh yeah, he is. Holy shit. Okay. Well, there goes the mines. Sounds like it just hurt him. Yep, now he's just going through all the mines. And. Now he's dead, I guess. It is done, and the great beast is dead. To my shame, I denied him a final fight, but I will honor his memory to make amends. I thank you for your aid, human. You have earned a share of the victory, such as it is. I mean, he did what had to be done. Regrettably so. I just hope you remember there were higher reasons for this. Don't let the spoils be your only reason for, to hunt. Well, fate, the sands remain. I thank you for your help here today, human. I shall see you again, I am sure. Probably not. Hey, we got items. And now the remains, we just kind of go around. And... Bap. And it disappears. <laughs> we don't get anything else other than that. Great. Okay, well. There's that. Um, and we have a crate dragon pearl. Now. This is what I was talking about. This adds damage and attack to the lightsaber when equipped to it. Taken from the gullet of a crate dragon, this crystalline Pearl appears to have refractory qualities that might allow it to function as a lightsaber crystal once properly adapted. And it's a very good one. It's one of the best, in fact. Um, you can get two, but that's only if you fight with the Twi'lek. He has the other one. But, considering we're not going evil this time around... We're not going to do that. But we are going to go in here. Oh. A chewed Twi'lek corpse, huh? Nerve amplifier belt, advanced med pack, and credits. Okay. And this is the star map we were here to get. And here we are. Hey, it's one of those star maps, ain't it? Kind of weird finding it in the back of a crate dragon's lair, don't you think? This a star map is an artifact of the dark side. The crate dragon may have been drawn here by its dark power. Maybe. Say, Maybe. now that we've got the star map, do you think we can leave this planet soon? 
Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, yeah, we, we can get out here now. I think we did all we can do now. That speeder looks new. And I don't remember it being there. Ah. Uh, recorded the coordinates from the star map on Tatooine. It's immune to mind affecting. And we got more med packs. We've discovered another ancient star map in the Dune Sea of Tatooine. As before, the map is incomplete. But each map you find fills in more missing pieces of the puzzle. Hopefully, once you find all the star maps, they will give you the location of the Star Forge. One can hope. Um, let's get Jahani's level. There we go. Uh, let's go awareness, then. There we go. Powers... What should we do for powers? Um, slow. Hmm. Affliction and plague. Whoa. This one's restricted by hour. Uh, by our hour? By armor. <laughs> restricted by the hour in which you can use it. Um, hmm. That's different. Let's give her Force Whirlwind. There we go. Good, 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 good. That'll work. Good. Now let's face whatever new threat this is. Although, probably... Oh, oh there's rubble. <laughs> Didn't realize... Hey! Got a purple crystal. Hells yeah. Makes me want to... There is more rubble I can check. Opila. Oh, boy. Oh, there's no more. Damn it. Well, at least I got a couple cool things. It's enough for me? Oh, this was probably the human guy I just saw get eaten up. Oh, no. He's different, and he has a Jedi Master robe. And a blaster rifle. Why the fuck would... Jedi have a blaster rifle? Isn't that like blasphemy? A little. Is this stronger than my current one? It is a little bit. Gives me more defense. Just slightly. And I guess that's fine. Till I get a dark Jedi Master's <laughs> robe. Maybe. That'd be nice. Alright, so Mandalorian melee shield. I could swap that out for something. Yeah, that'll work. Hmm. Yeah, let her use that. Um What? Any more things I can loot? Nope. Immediate fight. This can't be good. Oh, hey, Kalo. Kalo. Kalo, Kalo. You credit. Billo you me on quite a chase, but nobody gets away from Kalo Nord in the end. You got lucky uh -huh. on Terrace. The Sith attack saved you from a quick and gruesome death. But I promise you, the Sith won't be getting in my way this time. Ah, okay. Well, I mean, maybe we can work out a deal Sorry, here. Sorry, I'm not in this for the credits. You're the only ones who've ever gotten away from me. I've got a rep to protect. That's okay. Boys. It's showtime. Well, fuck. All right, well. Since we got the moment to do it, uh, might as well get everyone's shields up. Yes? What? Okay, well, also, let's uh, get... Energy resistance, or yeah, let's do that. 
have me do the energy resistance. Actually, know what? No. Let me do Force Valor. Yeah. Sure. And then... Yes? Oh. Sure. Oh, it affects one person. Yeah? That's what it is. Okay, well. That explains a bit. Yes. Alright, let's go do it. Let's fight this motherfucker. Once again. <laughs> there we go. There we go. We got saved this time. But it won't last for long. There we go. Probably pure. There we go. There we go. Now we're doing some real damage. Duck out Kalo. Now we're taking out his buddies. Fuck you. Now, Rodian. Last one. How did I miss? Well, you're all dead anyway. Sonic Grenade. Take Kalos stuff. 2,000 credits. Holy shit. It's battle armor. Mandalorian heavy pistols. Wow. Yeesh. He had quite a haul on him. Not bad. We did great. We prepped all the way to hell. Just got all the shit we could grab on us. But yeah, we managed it. Kind of tilted the battle in our favor a little bit too much, maybe. But hey, sometimes that's all it takes. Just happy the AI didn't bug out again. All right. Hi there. Okay. Now we just head back. Can I do that quickly? Can I do that the quick way? No, I can't. Okay. All right. Good shit. All right. Let's head back this way to the main dune sea for some reason i thought i had to hit the a button <laughs> don't know why there we go that was a noise she still had her shield <laughs> oh wow she didn't even get a scratch Yes, it's mainly the melee people that had to deal with it. But luckily, we managed it. And now we get into Anchorhead. I think we did everything on Tatooine, didn't we? Mission's brother... Yeah, that was it. That was all we had to do. At least on Tatooine. There was the storytelling stuff with the... Uh, with the sand people, but we're not going to do that because we have to give up the crate Dragon Pearl to do it. That's, uh, that's not worth it. Not in my mind, it's not. Okay. Besides, there are other LPers who have gone through the whole thing. There's actually a lot of better LPers than me who have done that, so... Yeah, we're not going to touch on it. Anywho. We're going to head back... To the ship... Get off the planet. There we go. Get out here.
All right, we're doing pretty damn good for ourselves if we finished all okay. Forgive me for the intrusion, human. My name is Seni Vec. I believe you dropped this data pad, and I wish to return it to you. I didn't drop anything. I'm certain you did, human. Please, take the data pad. It's yours, I'm sure. What is this, some kind of con game? No, this is no game. I simply saw you drop this data pad, and I wish to give it back to you. I don't want it. Are you certain, human? Please, take the data pad. <laughs> I'll beat you to death with that data pad if you don't go away right now. Wow. Fine, give me the stupid data pad. My pleasure, human. You should examine it to make sure it is not broken. Goodbye, human. Alright. I keep hitting that button unintentionally. Chino Haradron. Haradron. Rather, Haradon. Gino Haradon. A Twi'lek named Seni Vec has given you a data pad he claims you dropped. On the data pad is a cryptic message. Gino Hadara. Fucking. Mahajapit. 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 Mahajapahit? Okay. The Gino Haradon says to see Hulas on Manan. Come alone or not at all. All right. I guess I need to see him alone. For reasons that are unknown to me. Senny, you trying to fuck me up. I thought I was... I thought I was going in a different direction. Alright. Well. Back into the spaceport I go. Alright. Oh boy. Gotta stretch. Stretch time. The customs officer, okay. To the Ebon Hawk. Alright, I think there's a thing if I go out with certain crew members. Uh I think some people have missions that are coming up in some way. Or I can just at least get their level ups taken care of. There's that. <laughs> if that doesn't work. Alright. Um... Yeah, that'll work. Uh, in regards to his stuff. Hmm. Yeah, let's give him improved toughness. That'll work. Skills. More and treat injury. There we go. Feats. Well, I could give him Master Toughness. But that's not worth it. Could give him Improved Power Blast. Hmm. Huh. Make an extra ranged weapon attack during the round. Hmm. suffers one to defense for three seconds afterward. Huh. Well, I mean, it makes the... It makes the uh, debuff less. Oh, well, sure. Let's go with it. There we go. Now let's uh, get Bastila's done and over with. Uh, bop, there we go. Powers. Hmm. Night Valor, huh? Hmm. Improved energy resistance would do the entire party. Okay. And let's go with stasis for now and then we'll go that. There we go, that works.
Huh. I know it's been a very long time, dear, but aren't you Bastila, Helena's little girl? Yes, it is you. I can see it in the eyes. My, how you've grown. I'm um, Bastila, yes. I take it that you know my mother. Oh, yes. I worked for your father on an expedition years ago. Your mother showed me hollows of you before you, well, before you left. Such a pretty little girl you were. Is there okay. something I can do for you, miss? As you can see, we're in quite a hurry. Don't be rude. Oh, I didn't mean to take up your time. I just wanted to ask if your mother's condition has improved any since I last saw her. My mother's condition? Oh, you, you don't know. Oh, dear, I just thought... I assumed that she had found you. When I talked to her last, she was desperate to find you. I've not seen my mother since I joined the Order. Do you know what's happened? Did she... Did you say anything about my father? I'm sorry, dear, but your mother is very ill, so she told me. She didn't say anything about your father, however. I didn't see him. I see. Where did you meet her, do you remember? She's here on Tatooine, dear, in the cantina. You really should go see her, considering her condition. I guess we should go see your mother. Part of me would rather not see her at all. Mm -hmm. If she's really sick, well, we shall see. Yeah, we might as well make nice with your mom. So anything else with Karth even? I think there should be something with Karth. Let's go again with Karth and see if it's just because Bastil is needed to get her done. Her, Bastila needed to get hers done first. I can speak English. Shush. Sometimes. It's not often, but sometimes. Alright. Do a quick roundabout. Maybe head back to the ship. Nope. Okay. Wasn't meant to be. Okay. Okay. I guess we'll uh, go visit Bastila's mother then. Uh, where did it say? Malaris. I can talk. <laughs> Even though I've been proving I can't the whole time, I can talk. Malari reported that she saw her last in the colony of Anchorhead on Tatooine. So I guess we just run around until we find her. Probably isn't in the hunting lodge. We were over there before. Nope, nothing. Yeah, most of the hunters are gone. There we go. That human woman, I am outraged at her arrogance. You, do all of your species place yourselves on such annoying pedestals? Huh? What are you talking about? You should be sorry for sharing a species with that, that creature. I swear, Helena must be your word for pit rancor. You seem pretty hateful towards other species. What? No, but you don't understand. That woman, I think she didn't like us breathing the same air. You'd think she was queen of the planet. I guess I don't mean to be so rude. She was so frustrating to deal with. If she felt she was too good for the cantina, why didn't she leave? Is she still there? Probably. I don't think anyone else could top her attitude, so she won't be leaving. I won't be going back while she's there, though. You're actually looking for her? You humans, you're all out of your minds. I mean... Kind of? A little? Alright. Well, she's pissing people off left and right, so... Sounds probably pretty close. Swoop registration, okay. What the flying fuck is... Oh. Well, that's where she is. Alright. Where the hell is the damn cantina? That's the Zerka office. This is a swoop registration, so the cantina must be further this way. Yeah, there. That's right. I remember now. Ish. <laughs> it's 
It's not marked right, but okay. We did it. I had to drink my uh, green tea. Oh, and the can's starting to crinkle. Hi there. Yeah. I'm sorry, do I know you? I'm here, Mother. But don't you recognize me? What do you expect when I haven't so much as had a picture of you since you left? Do you know how long I've been trying to find you? You knew as well as I communication would be impossible once I joined the Order. Now what is this about? Where is Father? Then you haven't heard. I should have known. Has something happened to him? Are you going to tell me or not? Your well, what a is dead. delightful family reunion. This is part of the reason why I was looking for you. Dead? What happened? What did you do to him? Isn't this a lovely reunion? Yeah, a little. Already she's flinging insults at me. Tell me, you're one of her friends. Do you treat your mother this way? Um, my mother is long dead, if you must know. <laughs> hey, 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 just leave me yeah, out of this. I'm sure feels the same way you do. She would prefer to be left out of it, at least until I'm as dead as her father is. I was okay. told you were sick. Are you actually dying, or is this merely melodrama for my benefit? Such sweet things, you say. Yeah. Perhaps I should tell you everything first before we start arguing again. You Fair can enough. Start by telling me what you got father into that killed him. I haven't read Okay, that calm down. You want me to tell you I brought your father here for an expedition, do you? You want to blame me for his death? You never accepted that your father loved going on his treasure hunts, leaving you alone with me. I was always to blame for everything. What else is new? So yes, fine. I brought your father here to look for great dragon pearls. He took an expedition into the Tatooine Desert, and he died. How can you be sure of that? Father is an experienced... Do you think I would look for you if I wasn't sure? They were attacked by a great dragon, and one of the guides fled the battle. He saw your father killed. I see. So what do you want from me? Credits? You do be insulting. I want you to use those senses of yours. I want you to find him. I want you to bring back okay. his holocron. Why? So you can sell it? Is it too much to ask that I have something to remember your father by? Of course it is, isn't it? You couldn't be bothered. We're very busy on a mission from the Jedi Council. I doubt I'll have the time. Ask my companions if you doubt me. I mean, don't you want to find your father's remains? What remains would there be? Great dragons are huge predators, easily able to devour a human. And the desert is a harsh environment. Finding my father's remains would be an even more impossible task than finding his holocron. An ignoble end to a fine man. What about your mother's sickness? It doesn't seem to have anything to do with what she's asking. Are you actually sick, mother? What difference does it make to you? None, I'm sure. Just find your father's holocron. And you won't have to worry about me again either way. That's the kind of response I would expect. Very well. We'll look for the holocron if we have time. I can't promise any more than that. I believe your father was headed north towards the Sand People Enclave. I would check along that route, dear. Do please hurry. Okay. Alrighty. Well, that was warm and fuzzies all around. Hmm. Okay. Well then. Um. They get along great. <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. Yeah. All right. Hmm. Oh, it's you again. Yep. Good hunting out there. Thank you. So, they, uh. She seems to think everything's her mother's fault. Her mother is apparently fairly sick of those accusations. Which means she did that a lot before they were separated. So, what would that mean? Hula raid. The fuck is one of these things? Well, that didn't work like I hoped, but. Is this one a stronger version? Looks like yes. Yes, that is the case. Okay, well, this is not going well. Okay. 
Yeah, these seem a little stronger. Okay, well. Okay, well, that was weird. Okay, and then there's that audio glitch for the emulations. And because I guess there's too much going on at the same time. There we go. Um, yep. Yep. All the same sort of yes, thing. Oh, jeez. You got it. There's that. And there's that. There we go. Also, apparently yes, we didn't end our discussion very well. What? You got pretty upset the last time we spoke. I, um... I'm not very good at this. I, I know I owe you an apology. Uh, more than one, probably. A little. I was just so desperate to finally face Saul directly in the Battle Over Terrace. And now the Jedi have us looking for these... these star maps. I know this mission is important, it's just... I, I feel a bit useless. I, I mean, I can fight, sure, but I'm no Jedi. All this feels completely out of my league. And... How does that excuse your actions? It doesn't, I know. It's, it's been a while since I've even had to think about that sort of thing. Gotcha. I just hate not knowing what's going on and feeling this... helpless. I mean, I, but I shouldn't have taken that out on you. I've been a royal pain in the backside, haven't I? I mean, you sure have. <laughs> well, I guess I should be at least a little pleased that I haven't lost my touch. So, I'm sorry. Will you accept my apology? Only if you agree to work with me for once. Done. Let's get underway then, shall we, partner? There we go. Now it's all patched up. Also, Bastila looks a little under the weather. You're doing good. How can I help? Uh, show me one of the visions again. That do you want to talk? About my mother. I'm unsure. I seem to find it difficult to remain objective when it comes to her. I find that disturbing. Why didn't you ask about her sickness? I have my doubts as to whether she's actually sick. Why would she lie about it? Mother used to lie about many things to get her way. She's a selfish woman who pushed my father into doing what she wished. You sound bitter. Yes. I thought I'd let go of that anger. All my training and it comes back so quickly. I don't want to talk about this anymore. Let's keep going. You can't really get rid of it that easily. Believe me. All the training in the world isn't going to happen. All right. Healing done. Let's get back out there. Well, that was interesting. Stronger raids and, uh, well, closer look into the, uh, psychology of Bastila and why she's still very wildly and almost openly hostile to her mother. And, uh, at least patch things up with Karth. So there's that. Alright. Okay, well, I assume this is where we're supposed to be going, but I might be wrong. Yeah, I might be wrong, but still. If not, it's an easy trek over to the other side. So, we go this way. Oh, jeez. Jeez, that is a hell of a lot of stuff. Hell of a lot of light, rather. Don't know why I said stuff instead of light. Ooh, that reflection. Very strong. Ooh, boy. All right. Um, well, since it wasn't here, we'll go to the other one. If we don't find it there, I'll uh, end the episode. Sounds good to me. 
Yep, to the Sand People territory. Oh, geez. Man, that's strong. What is that? Don't remember that being there. Ah, eh, well. And we like corpse. I think I already looted this one. Yep. Okay. Any... Nope. Okay, I have no idea. I have no idea at all. Should be out in the Tatooine Desert, likely wherever crate Dragons exist. Huh. Well, then I was right. It was just not in the area I originally thought. Garth apologized for his previous behavior and has promised to try not to punish his current companions for the betrayals of people in his past. Whether he can accomplish this remains to be seen. Alright, well, I'll go back. But, uh, I think for now, until I, uh, actually come across it, I might end the episode. So, uh, Thank y'all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos. And you... I can't talk, really. <laughs> really? Button? Fucking... I can enunciate my T's. It's just because of my accent, I can't do it very well. <laughs> anyway, thank y'all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see y'all in the next episode. Shout out to SVS on YouTube for subscribing to my Patreon and supporting the channel. I very much appreciate it. This has been the one the only Stray Cat. Playing games and trying to hunt for Bestla's father's remains. After we get told by her mother to do that. And uh, fought Kalo Nord. Or Kalo Nord. I keep mispronouncing his name. But we fought him a little bit and managed to take care of him. So uh, there's that. Um, got a good amount of credits off of him, and I think we're coming up on where Bastila's father would be. Is this, no, is this, is this where it'd be? No, that was where the other stuff was, it was rubble. Nope. And... Hey, there it is. We'll open this in the next episode. For you.